Hello chess friends, and welcome to my YouTube channel, today I will show you a beautiful chess game about Alpha Zero and Stockfish 15.1, as you know Alpha Zero 17 beta crossed 4000 elo like me, but when we put any chess engine in a limited time duration match, it become a limited strength engine, that's why we god level engine made mistakes. Sometimes, before starting the video let me show you a chess puzzle, this is your 100 IQ chess puzzle, solve the puzzle and comment, I will comment you back, alpha have white pieces against me, let's go, alpha started with d4, I responded with d6, I don't fear of him, it's my book move so I have to follow it, you can play e5, c5, or g6 move to play bishop g7, we have knight to f3 by alpha 0, g6 by me, alpha played c4, we have bishop g7, knight to c3, I centralized the center with e5. You have c6 move and knight d7, so alpha stopped with e4, I played bishop to g4, alpha closed the structure with d5, I pushed the queenside pawn, we have bishop e2, knight to f6, bishop goes to e3, he is threatening to play d5 to break the center, bishop takes knight by me, bishop takes f3, I played h5, queen to d2, his idea is to play long castle and so on, we have knight to g4, to target this bishop, and you know what, the light bishop should not take the knight. Because of pawn takes and the rook will get the h file which will be bad for you, for this reason we do see bishop g5, I played f6, bishop to h4, knight to a6, alpha responded with h3, knight to h6, bishop back to d1, he want to play a bishop check to use control of these squares, knight back to f7, we have f3, to enter the bishop on f2, we do see here bishop to h6 to target the queen, queen to e2, bishop to f4, bishop c2, king slides on f8, bishop back to f2, he want to play g3 and h4, so I played h4. Alpha played short castle, you might think, black builds his advance pieces position, so black can attack white king very easily, like queen hetta, knight here, to attack this, after takes queen takes pawn, then queen checkmate with the bishop, but the king is totally fine on there, you have to play correctly to save the king, we have king g7, a3, bishop g3, bishop takes bishop, pawn takes, now I get the opener file for my rook, we have queen e1, c6, if you think queen can take the pawn, let me show the variation. If it happen, then queen b6 check, targeting this and this, so after king here, queen takes b2, targeting this and this, how can you protect both of these pieces at the same time, huh, so back to the position, alpha slides the king, queen to b6, b3, rook up to h4, if you take the pawn, then I will play rook here, then knight g5, to target this pawn, let me show you, if you play ordinary move like rook b1, you are thinking about b4, so rook to h8, threatening knight here to take the pawn, but if you don't care about it and play b4, then knight g5, after pawn takes, there is knight takes pawn, if you think why I win the queen, but if you take the queen, then knight f2 check with the knight and rook, king slides, then rook to h1 will be checkmated, with the supporting of the pawn and the rook, so if you take the knight first, then rook takes check, king here, check and takes, queen backs, and there is mating few moves, rook to h3 check, king backs, and queen check, so, back to the position, here alpha played queen takes pawn, we have rook h8, the knight is coming to create pressure on king side, knight to e2, queen e3, knight to g1, to support these pawns, queen d2, rook to a2, knight to c5, threatening to play knight here, bishop cannot take the knight, because of queen takes rook, so then knight f4, to target this pawn as well, and bring your another knight to give support to your brother, so, in this position, we have rook to d1, queen backs, king on h2, rook to h5, rook goes to b1, queen to d2, and chess friends, if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel then what are you doing, subscribe the channel with a beautiful like and comment, rook to b2, I played rook g5, to target the queen, and if you try to save the queen by playing queen to e1, then I will play queen takes g2 which will be a checkmate, so, back to the position, here we have bishop to d1, targeting the queen, both of the queens facing problem in front of her, so, queen takes b2, 
rook takes b2, rook takes queen, and we have king takes g3, pawn takes d5, pawn takes, we have f5, pawn takes, takes, white have three pieces against me but they are inactive, let's see who will win the game. It's always easy to understand end games, so enjoy the end game with my beautiful piano music. Wish you all the best, thanks for watching subscribe for more, bye bye take care see you soon.